Wow, what a beautiful day to be nice. I don't know about you guys, but I have the sudden urge to graffiti something. Telepathy, the communication of thoughts or ideas from one person to another via brain waves. Ooh, cool. Let me try. Easter party. All right, the other princesses should be here any minute for our Easter party. Anna? It worked! What worked? My telepathic thoughts. I just communicated the idea of the Easter party to you. Well, that's because we're having an Easter party, Anna. I'm serious, Elsa. I sent you those thoughts without you even being in the room. Well, I don't know about all of that, but what I do know is I have the Easter baskets, I have the Easter eggs, all ready to go for our Easter egg hunt later. Oh, there are the other girls. Ooh, so exciting. I'll go get it. Hey, Anna. Hey, Snow. Oh, no dwarves today? Nah. It's off to work they go. Oh, totally. TV, that is. Come on in. Hey, Ariel. Hey, Anna. I thought you said you were bringing Sebastian. Well, I was going to, but he said he'd better stay under the sea. Oh, hi, Moana. Oh, you brought Hey Hey. Hi, Anna. I sure did. You have no idea how far we've come. Hey, hey, calm down. He loves Easter egg hunts. Oh, that's okay. Come on in. Hey, hey, just don't peck at anything, okay? Hmm, is that the doorbell? Oh, it's just Belle. Hey, girl. Hi, Anna. I'm so excited. I brought extra eggs. Did someone say eggs? Gaston. What? What? I always come prepared with five dozen, just in case. Gaston, no one invited you. Well, you ignored all my text messages. Get it? Ignored. <laughs> oh. Gaston, why don't you make like an egg and scram, bull? <laughs> nice one, Anna. Well, excuse me. Oh, so rude. Oh, I want to talk to your father about this one, Belle. Oh, don't you just love furs? Not really. I'm more of a black and purple, subtle sparkle kind of gal. Look, Mommy. She has ears like the Easter Bunny. Oh, let's get away from there, dear. She looks like a mean, mean bunny. Mean bunny? How rude. I'm clearly a dark fairy. <laughs> LOL, you the Easter Bunny? <laughs> Don't you have to be all warm and fuzzy inside? Speaking of, do you know where I could get some good rabbit fur? No, I don't. Nobody in their right mind wears fur anymore. Hey! And besides, I am sick of this place. It's so clean and normal. Blah! <laughs> I'm off to the Isle of the Lost. Ciao, ciao, Molly! Now off to find some rabbit fur. <laughs> All right, ladies, prepare yourselves for an excellent time. Yes, this year marks the fifth annual Arendelle Easter Egg Hunt. Yeah! <laughs> That's right. Elsa, Olaf, and I have colored dozens of eggs. We've also hidden lots of yummy chocolates and coins in a bunch of plastic eggs as well. Yes, whoever collects the most eggs by the end of the day, they get a grand prize. Anna, are you ready to help me hide these eggs? Um, Elsa, do, do I have to help hide the eggs? I mean, year after year, I never get to participate. Anna, really? Right now? I thought you were Snow excited. I'll help hide the eggs with you, Elsa. Aw, are you sure, Snow? That is so nice of you to offer. It's no problem at all, you guys. I think it'll be fun to hide the eggs. Ooh, yes! All right, you guys all stay here. Snow White and I will head out, hide the eggs. We'll come back when it's ready to start the hunt. Diablo? Um, uh, what are you doing back here so early, boss? Diablo, what are you doing using my crystal ball without my permission? Oh, that's what that thing is? Ah, oh, well, boss, you see, I was just, uh, clipping my nails when all of a sudden the crystal ball just magically turned on and, uh... Silence, Diablo. What do we have here? All right, you guys all stay here. Snow White and I will head out, hide the eggs. We'll come back when it's ready to start the hunt. <laughs> 
So the princesses think they can have an egg get together without me. I believe the correct term is Easter egg hunt. Shh, silence Diablo. I think it's time that some bunny teaches these princesses a lesson. <laughs> Am I right? Some bunny? <laughs> yeah, these princesses are about to have a bad hair day. Bad hair day? That doesn't even make sense, boss. Yes, it does, Diablo. I'm a rabbit, a hare. Get it? Ah. Whatever. I'm out of here, Diablo. I think some bunny has officially lost their marbles. Hey, this is Gabe from Beast Mode. Well, this sounds like the app for me. Do you want to go from Jack Frost to Jacked Frost? Why, yes. Yes, I do. Great. Today we're having a jumping jack party. On your mark, get set, go. Let's do 1,000 jumping jacks. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 232, 233, 234, 235, 991, 992, 993, 994, a little bit faster, Prince Adam. Whew, this new workout app is intense. Did he just call me Prince Adam? What was that, Mrs. Potts? You need help in the kitchen? Ugh, oh, the beast thinks he can copy me now and work out. Hmm, well, I'll show him. I'll be taking this. <laughs> Whew, okay, where was I? Oh, wait, where's my phone? Maybe I left it in the kitchen. I can't wait to get this Easter egg hunt underway. I know, right? How many eggs did Elsa say there were to find again? Well, I know that Elsa and I died about a dozen, and Belle brought some extras. <laughs> and I think Hey Hey might even have a few. So that makes... Oh my goodness! You guys, look! It's the Easter Bunny! It is I, the great and powerful Easter Bunny. Give me all your chocolate and candy or I will turn you into eggs. Hey, that's not very nice. Yeah, I thought the Easter Bunny was kind and left presents behind for well-behaved people. But you don't look like the Easter Bunny. <gasps> hey, that's because you're not the Easter Bunny. <gasps> Maleficent, what are you doing here? Yeah, and no bunny invited you. Oh yeah? Well, I think it's time for you girls to make your grand exit. All right, you girls, are you ready to go egg hunting? You girls? Um, Elsa? Where'd they go? I have no idea. I swear I just heard them a second ago. Wait a second. Do you hear that? Listen. Yeah, you have the right to remain silent. Help! Elsa! I said quiet. You're giving me a headache. And besides, your little ice queen brat sister can't hear you all the way out here. Oh yeah? Well, I have telepathic brain powers and I can send messages to my sister. Telepathic? <laughs> More like telepathetic. I'm serious, Maleficent. I'm sending her a message to rescue us here, right now. Wherever we are. Yeah, where are we anyway? This place is so unkept. I think the word you mean is creepy. Elsa, come find us. Maleficent has taken us. Oh, you don't like it? Well, sorry, my little precious princess, but you're on the Isle of the Lost now. Get used to it, okay? I could never get used to living here. Yeah, besides, only villains live here, and we're not villains. Well, I could arrange for that. <gasps> a cauldron! Don't you dare put a spell on us, Maleficent! Or what? Or I'll, um, I'll call Prince Adam. He'll come and... Ooh, that hunky Prince Adam, you say? Hmm. Give me your phone. I'll call him myself. <laughs> Who is this? Gaston? What are you doing with Prince Adam's phone? Ew, Gaston has Adam's phone? What? He uh, let me borrow it. Sure he did. 
Well, since I have you on the phone, why don't you swing by the aisle? You can help me. Is Belle there? Yes, she is. And you can help me get rid of- uh, On my way! Uh -huh. Hello? Ugh, that Gaston. What's in an egghead? Now, nah, where was I? Oh, where did I put my pixie dust? Oh, here it is. Oh my gosh, is that Tinkerbell's fairy dust? What? You stole it from her? As if. Did you forget that I'm a powerful dark fairy? This is mine from a long, long time ago. What are you gonna do with it? Well, with just a pinch of this and some magic words, I can reverse your sweet, kind characters and turn you into rotten to the core villain kids. You wouldn't dare. Oh, I wouldn't, would I? Reverse their personalities good no more from kind-hearted princess to rotten to the core. Oh no, she's putting a spell on us. I feel... Oh, excuse me, my allergies are acting up. Or you breathed in some of that magic dust stuff. Silence, Diablo. Sorry, as you were saying, I feel a little rotten. Yeah, a little W-I-C-K-E-D. I swear I could hear Anna calling my name. She was like, help, Elsa, help. But then she sort of said, rotten? You didn't hear any of that? I'm sorry, I didn't hear anything. Really? Nothing? That's strange. Hmm, <gasps> I know, I'll call her. Hi, you've reached Princess Anna. Straight to voicemail? That's not like Anna, she always answers her phone. I know. What if we had more eyes to look for them? That's a great idea, Snow, but I thought you said the dwarves were at work. No, I mean the birds. <whistles> they can help look for her. That's brilliant, they can cover way more ground than us. You think they'll help? They said they can help. Wow, what a beautiful day to be nice. I don't know about you guys, but I have the sudden urge to graffiti something. No, better yet, let's get out of here. I think we should go egg some buildings. That's so bad, Belle. I love it. I'm kind of thinking of stealing Maui's fish hook. Yeah, totally. And I was thinking, maybe Ursula and I can team up and steal all the other mermaids' voices. Nice. I think I'm gonna steal Elsa's freezing powers and take over Arendelle. <laughs> oh, Belle, are you growing horns out of your head? I sure am. I'm the new dark fairy in town. Got a problem with it? Who do you think you are, Marty McFly? Scram, get out of here. Later. Uh-huh, uh-huh. They did? What? Oh no! Oh no! Wait, what did, what did they say? The birds said that Princess Anna and her friends were taken by a raven named Diablo. Diablo? Wait a second, that's Maleficent's pet bird. It is? Oh no! She means bad business. Aurora was telling me about her. Oh yeah, she does. Wait a second, does your bird friend know where they're being held? The birds say the Isle of the Lost. Do you know where that is? You bet I do. Come on, quick, we're gonna have to catch a boat. Thanks, little birdie. Bye. Diablo. I've been thinking, aside from stopping the villains, I think that we should get a puppy. A puppy? As in a cute, adorable, sweet puppy? Yes. Now, where could we get one of those? The pound? We should definitely adopt. How should I know? Why don't you call your friend Cruella? Cruella? Oh no, the puppies! I have to call her. A new scarf, new slippers, hashtag winning! <laughs> oh. Cruella de Bill speaking. If I don't scare you, not a thing will. <laughs> How can I help you? Cruella, it's Maleficent. I'm calling because... Oh, hey, Mally. How are you, darling? Are you still getting confused for a mean Easter bunny? <laughs> fur, fur, stop the magic.
badness, more cute animals to stop the badness. Uh, what are you muttering over there? Oh, I feel so... Emotional! <laughs> Alrighty, now that that's done, it's time to stop those villains and make some low-carb muffins. Did someone call for a stud muffin? Gaston, would you mind taking off your shoes and keeping your voice down? I wouldn't want to disturb the neighbor. No, you're my favorite muscle. Come again. Well, look who it is, Gaston. Oh, hey, my little belly button. You're looking, um, different. You know what I've been thinking? I don't think Prince Aaron is rotten enough for me. Maybe you and I should go out. Aaron? You mean, uh... Adam? Belle, are you feeling okay? You seem a little bit on edge, you know? Are you talking back to Belle? Yeah, I thought you were a villain. I don't think he's rotten enough for you, Belle. Huh? Belle? Are you... Are you growing horns on your head? Yeah, so what if she is? We're villains now, okay? Get used to it. Ladies, ladies, calm yourselves. Muffins? Or calming chamomile tea? What is going on? Is everybody taking crazy pills or something? No, but I do like this villain spell that we're under. Am I right? <laughs> <laughs> what did you do, Maleficent? You need to change them all back immediately. Oh no, they're bad now. I'm done with my old magic ways. It's bad. They're bad and being bad is bad for you. Speaking of, you're bad now, so I'm going to have to lock you up. Lock me up? Yes. Every villain must be locked up and put away for good. It's the rules. What? I am not a villain. I am an antagonist. They are very different. Just ask Belle. Tell her, Belle. Belle reads books. She knows. Belle books. Tell her book things. I don't have time for any reading. Lock him up. Lock, Lock him up. up. Lock, Lock him up. up. Lock, Lock him, him up. up. Oh, my. Maleficent. Look. Somebody's littering over there. Oh, my. Look. Oh, no. Where? Here it is. What's this? Eh. Oh, so many words. Millions and millions of words. Oh, okay. A picture. Uh, uh, good to rotten. Oh, good, good, good. This is it. Uh, oh, I don't know what this says. This is too many words. Bell, I am trying here. Oh, oh, that's a good picture. Gaston, stop what you're doing right this second. Elsa, uh, uh, other princess, it's not what you think. Yeah, right. Drop the pixie dust. Ooh, look who it is. If it isn't the snow brat. Excuse me? Anna. And you heard what she said. If it isn't egg white. Why would you say that? Oh yeah? Well maybe we don't want you to know, okay? I tried to tell you! This villain, Belle, is cuckoo for Cocoa Puffs! Maybe now you'll believe me that I'm trying to reverse the spell! But I can't read this. Oh hey Elsa. Hi Snow White. What a pleasant surprise you coming over. Would you care for some freshly squeezed orange juice? Huh? Orange juice? Oh, would you ladies please excuse me? I almost forgot. It's time to lock up Gaston and the rest of the villains. Lock up the villains? But you are a villain. <laughs> oh, Elsa, you're such a kidder. Gaston, don't put up a fight. Please follow me to the dungeon. Oh, Elsa, Snow, read the spell, quick! Okay, reverse their personalities, bad no more. From rotten hearted villain to so sweet you adore. What happened? Where am I? Gaston, what are you doing here? Do you want to get married, Belle? Absolutely not. Yay, it worked. <laughs> Why are you all in my castle right now? I think you put us under a villain spell. But I think some of it may have spilled onto you or maybe you breathed it in because I've never seen you so nice before. I know, right? Freshly squeezed orange juice? Ugh, out! Get out! Anna, are you almost ready? Yeah, I'm coming. I wanted to pick out the perfect outfit for tonight. We're going to have so much fun. I can't wait to go to the movies with all of our princess friends. We'll order popcorn, ooh, and even maybe some Sour Patch Kids. 
I'm ready! Anna, are you wearing Vanellope's hoodie? Yeah, you can't go see Wreck-It Ralph 2 and not dress up. That should be our friends now. Doors open, come on in! Are you guys ready to wreck it? Ralph! Ralph. <laughs> Ooh, we're going to wreck it, Ralph! Ugh, they think they're so clever. Princesses. Why do they foil my plan every single time? I can never win! Well, there are like six of them and one of you, so you're kind of outnumbered. Diablo, you brilliant bird, you're right. In order to beat the gang, I have to create my own gang. Hmm, I have to make some calls. We made it! Thanks for the ride in your new Sebring, Ariel. Of course! And we have Prime Princess Parking. I'm so excited to see this movie. The first one was so good. Let's go in. I think we have just enough time to get some snacks. Ooh, yeah. Or maybe Elsa can whip us up some ice cream. Ooh, that sounds so delicious. <laughs> <laughs> it's gonna be so good. Let's go. Now, do you all see what I mean? Mm-hmm. I can't believe they went to go see Wreck-It Ralph 2. You know, I auditioned to be Ralph. Really? Uh, Jafar, I really don't think you're the type. Silence, you fool! My acting coach says I'm a diamond in the rough. Touchy, touchy. The point is, now that we villains have all banded together, we can finally take down those princesses once and for all. Yes! yes. yes. <laughs> the only thing standing in our way is the Ice Queen. Her powers could turn us into popsicles. Yes, and she can be kind of mean. Yes, tell me about it. I can't tell you how many times she's turned down my marriage proposals. Yes, it's because I was trying to take over her kingdom, but there's a nice way to decline, you know. We need to get to that theater and get Elsa. Wings of night, wings take flight. Take us to the movie theater in a flash of light. Now to trick Elsa. Ooh, I know. Give me your phone. Okay, we've got popcorn. I've got Kit Kats. And we've got soda. I think we're ready. Oh, and I have a phone call. Sorry, I gotta take this. Hello, this is Elsa. You guys go in, I'll meet you in there. Oh, hi, Elsa. This is <clears throat> Cinderella. <laughs> Cindy, how are you? What's going on, girl? I'm actually coming to meet you. <laughs> Did Anna tell you? Weird, she didn't. Well, anyway, could you come outside? <laughs> I think I'm lost. <laughs> oh, okay, I'll be right there. Cindy, we're over. Maleficent, Hans, Cruella, Jafar? I call upon this witching hour, take this girl's power, and fly us back to the tower. Anna, I can't believe you pulled strings to get us a private screening of Wreck-It Ralph 2. Yeah, Oka owns the theater. He's pretty cool about it. You guys, the previews are almost over and Elsa isn't here yet. Oh no, what should we do? I'll go look for her. Elsa? Elsa? Hey friends, it's Elsa. No, sorry I missed you. Leave Is a message. Is voicemail? This is not like her. Ugh. Elsa! Come on, Elsa, pick up, pick up. Wait, what's this? Maleficent Spellbook? Oh no, this can't be good. I've got to tell the girls. <laughs> not so powerful now, are you, Elsa? Now that you don't have your little friends to save you. And you can't use your freezing powers. <laughs> oh, I'm Elsa. I'm just a normal queen now. Ooh. <laughs> just you wait. My friends will save me. Just watch. So I feel like Maleficent took Elsa and then left this behind on accident. I'm so sorry I had to call you guys out of the movie. Psh. No way! Saving Elsa is way more important than the movie. Yeah, we have to stop Maleficent. 
Are there any spells we could use in there? Yeah, fight fire with fire. Let me look. Oh my gosh, you guys, here's a superhero spell. I don't know, you guys, this could be really dangerous. There's no way we can stand up to Maleficent otherwise. She's too strong. Read it, Belle. Okay, here it goes. No longer are we pretty flowers. Give us all superpowers. Whoa! I feel different! Whoa! 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 Oh my gosh, you're flying! Whoa! I have water powers! Anna, stop talking about sandwiches at a time like this! What? I'm hungry! Wait a second! I wasn't talking about sandwiches, I was just thinking about sandwiches. Did you just read my mind? mind? I can read minds! Anna's thinking about sandwiches, Moana misses Hey Hey, Ariel can't believe she can fly, and I can read minds! This is crazy! I just can't figure out what my superpower is. Rapunzel? Are you there? We, we can't see you! I'm right here! Um, I think you've gone invisible! What? You mean you can't see me at all? Wow, this is crazy! I wonder what my superpower is! Uh, is it just me or is maybe it's getting hot in here? Anna! Your hands are on fire! Ah! I have fire powers! This is so cool! Whoa! Be careful with that! Sorry! Okay, let's go stop these villains and save Elsa! So, we finally got Elsa! <laughs> 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 uh, so, uh, now what do we do? Uh, we could try to marry someone. We've done that before. We can go by fur. No one wants fur. No, we're villains. We have to do something more devious. Uh, you can just let me go already. Never. I say we harness Elsa's freezing powers and bring an endless winter to all of Fantasyland. <laughs> hmm, sounds kind of cold. Yes, it's a good idea in theory, but we'd all have to live in it. The colder the weather, the better the fur. Not so fast, villains. What? Who's there? Here to save the day, flying in the air, it's a bird, it's a fish, no wait, it's Princess Ariel! Mind your own business, it's Princess Belle with mind powers! Feeling hot hot hot? Watch out for Princess Anna and her fire powers! Now you see her, now you don't! It's Princess Rapunzel! What are you gonna do now? I know what Moana's gonna do. She's gonna use her water powers! Yay, this is so awesome! Blah, blah, blah. Bring it on, princesses. Oh, it's been rotten. Moana, Maleficent's about to hit you with a beam of magic! You can't stand up to my hypnotism powers. You're getting very sleepy. Oh no, I'm not. I had my coffee this morning. Wait, what's happening? I'm getting very sleepy. Oh! My side burns! <laughs> the 
Rapunzel, everyone's preoccupied. Go rescue Elsa. Flower gleam and glow, let your power shine. Make the clock reverse, remove this force field curse. <gasps> Thank you so much, Rapunzel. Let's go. You guys, we have to stop these villains once and for all. Ready? One, two, three. Princess Power! No! Oh. Curses! Foiled again. Well, if we're going to be in here a while, I may as well finish my nap. <gasps> Nighty night. Seriously? He's supposed to be a super villain. Look at him. Might as well have a nightcap on. We did it. We saved Elsa. Yeah, you guys, thanks for saving me. Of course. We had some help from our cool new superpowers. Oh my gosh, Anna, you're right. I think we can still make the movie. Oh my goodness, I forgot that you can still read my thoughts. Yes, let's go see if Oaken can figure something out for us. I'll fly us over. Sounds <laughs> super. <laughs> Mayoko! Oh, hi, Eugene. Uh, Flynn, it's so nice of you to bring my mail in for me. No problemo, Ponzi. Let's see, bills, bills, invitation to the ball, bills. Whoa, pause, rewind, a ball? Oh yeah, looks like it's from Cinderella and Prince Charming. Check it out. Princess Cinderella and Prince Charming request the honor of your presence at a royal ball this Saturday to unveil a new statue of the king. Wow, a life-size statue? Oh. Pardon me, a statue of the king's head only. Well, I've always said the king has a good head on his shoulders. I guess it'll still look good on a mantle? Ugh, I can't wait to have a castle of our own, Flynn. Throwing balls, making friends. Commissioning statues of our own heads. <sighs> <gasps> we need some ballroom dancing lessons, like yesterday. What my lady wants, she gets. Let's go. <gasps> Flynn, get my mail! Flynn, let's take dance lessons! Flynn, I can't wait to own our own castle together! Rapunzel has no idea what she really wants. She's far too young to be rushing off to any parties! Oh, what's this? <gasps> Flynn Rider, he's the bad influence on her! I have to get rid of him to keep Rapunzel and her hair all to myself. This is Snow amazing! We should really have more royal dances at our castle. That's what I've been saying! Names please! Princess Belle and Prince Adam. Adam, A, um, no Adam on the list. Let's see, Belle. Uh, Belle, Belle already checked in. Huh? Are you sure? Huh, trying to sneak into the ball by pretending to be Belle. Not gonna work with me. Move along, you two. Come on, Adam, let's go figure this out. <sighs> I never get invited to royal balls. This is late, ma'am. Oh, Gapo, uh, you're back from the dessert table. Yes, you ogre. Here. Uh, whoa! Did you steal a bunch of yummy fruit tarts? Something like that. <laughs> <gasps> Look! Cinderella and Prince Charming are about to make an announcement. Time to finally see the statue everybody's been talking about. Welcome everyone, and thank you so much for being here on this very special occasion. We know you admire the king as much as we do, and to celebrate his reign, we've commissioned a piece of art in his honor. Ready to see it, everyone? Three, two... <gasps> What's this? The statue! It's missing! And look! A fanny pack? <gasps> Flynn! Look! Hey, that's mine! And it's not a fanny pack, thank you very much. <laughs> oh, fanny pack! Oh man, that's good! <laughs> Alright, that's our cue. Let's go. 
Flynn Rider, aren't you a thief? Of course. You must have stolen the statue. But Charming, Flynn hasn't been a thief in a very long time. Cinderella's right. I, I haven't stolen anything in a very long time. That's all behind me. I have no idea how my bag got there. This is all so strange. Are you sure that Flynn stole the statue, Prince Charming? We can't take any chances. Guards, take Flynn to the dungeon. We've got to find that statue. Everyone else, I'm sorry, but the party is over. I spent my whole life as a thief avoiding this place, and now that I'm a good guy, I get locked up? Ugh, I know. Being trapped against your will is no fun. Can you think of any way to get me out? I mean, besides being locked away from you and our friends, the food here stinks. They don't even have YouTube. Or hair gel. I think you'd need to be a magician to sneak your way out of this place. Magic? That's it, Rapunzel! What do you mean? Your hair! Do you think it could unlock my cell door? It's worth a shot! Here, tie it around the lock. Okay, got it. That should do it. Perfect, okay. Flower gleaming glow, let your power shine, make the clock reverse, set free this flint of mine! <laughs> wow, it worked! <laughs> Okay, we better get out of here before the guards come to check on you. Uh, help me untie my hair. Oh no, you're tangled. What's going on down there? We gotta go. <gasps> Quick, hand me your sword. What are you gonna do with this? Whoa. Brown hair? Oh yeah, I forgot this is what happens when it gets cut. Stop right there! We gotta go! Actually, I wasn't allowed into the ball last night. What? Yeah, Mother Gothel used my name to get in, and she tricked the door guy. Hey girls, what did I miss? Whoa, nice haircut, Rapunzel! Oh my goodness, you look so different, but like in a good way. It looks good. Thanks! It's a long story, actually. I used my hair to get Flynn out of jail. Wait, Flynn was in jail? You guys didn't tell me? Well, Belle wasn't even at the ball last night. She has no idea what happened. But she did see Mother Gothel leaving. Oh, I almost forgot. Mother Gothel had a really heavy bag with her. So Prince Adam was able to obtain a copy of the guest list and she wasn't even on it. Interesting. Cinderella's calling me. Hello? Rapunzel, Flynn is missing. He's escaped from his jail cell. He might be dangerous. You need to be careful. Cindy, I promise you, Flynn is not a criminal. We think we know who actually stole the statue. Bring a guard and meet us outside Mother Gothel's tower. Mother Gothel's tower? Okay, Rapunzel, I, I trust you. <sighs> the statue is going to look perfect. Right by the fireplace, oh, where Rapunzel will comb her long, beautiful hair. <laughs> Think again, Gothel. Rapunzel, what have you done with your hair? Oh, you like it? I call it the Mother Gothel Can Never Trap Me Again, Bob. Very trendy. Confess, Gothel. We all know you're the one who took the statue. Me? Never. <gasps> Not my statue! I mean, bag. <gasps> I knew it! Flynn, I, I'm so sorry. She framed you with your fanny pack. Satchel. S Satchel. I'm sorry. Really, I am. Uh, no hard feelings, Charming. Guard, to the dungeon with her. No! No! Who gets a statue of only their head anyway? All right, all right, all right, okay, enough of all that. Right, Let's all right, go. I'm going. Move it.